the conflict that began in Ukraine in 2014 and escalated into a full-scale war in February 2022 has led to a significant increase in mental health needs among the population. Based on WHO global estimates, we can assume that approximately 10 million people in Ukraine may have mental health condition. To respond to mental health needs of the population during the war and recovery period, WHO, in collaboration with the government of Ukraine, with initiative of the First Lady of Ukraine, Alena Zelenska, and international and national partners, is working on development of a comprehensive mental health system that can efficiently address emergency needs of the population and offer good quality services in longer term perspective. Today, we focus on introducing mental health services in primary health care using MHCAP technical package, developing specialized services such as community mental health teams, building knowledge about self-help stress management strategies using self-help plus technical package, and protecting the rights of people with mental health conditions. WHO also provides technical support and facilitates coordination of more than 300 organizations involved in the humanitarian response in Ukraine. The WHO advocates for the emergency response and recovery efforts in the area of mental health to be aligned with the best international standards and planned in a way that further strengthens the mental health system of Ukraine. To facilitate this, WHO supported the development of the MHPSS operational roadmap, which became a consensus of all stakeholders regarding priority actions in different sectors. The war in Ukraine is ongoing, which is leading to a further increase in the need for mental health services. WHO remains committed to support the effort of the government of Ukraine to meet these needs. We will continue to provide all necessary assistance to respond to the impact of the war on mental health. In the settings where national resources are stretched, WHO and partners continue to fill critical gaps in MHPSS services and supply through the coordinated intersectoral effort.